Oh, what's up? How you feeling, bro? You ready to start living that professional life? Hey, you think my mama still bring us dinner every now and then? We're about to start living our dreams, and you still think about your mom's Have cooking? Have you tasted what you be cooking in here? Yo, she making pork chops tonight. You know you love her pork chops. Honestly, no offense, but you need to get your head in the game. You need to start thinking about juggling practice and meetings, interviews. Interviews? What do you mean interviews? I'm here to play ball. That other stuff, that's gonna have to work itself out. Okay, but it won't just work itself out. Look, man, you and I both know you're not gonna play on Ignite forever. Which means you only got a little window to soak up all you can, both on and off the court. Yeah, yeah, you are right, all right? I'm gonna do whatever I gotta do to be the best player that I can be, but I just need you to tell me what to do off the court, and I'm gonna do it. Like we always did. Okay. What's different? It's not gonna work like that because we're not in high school no more, man. This is the start of, like, real life. Look, it's time that both of us figure it out what we really want to do. All right, that's going to come with some life decisions. All right, look, I can give you advice, but when it comes to making those decisions about who you want to be and who you don't want to be, only you can make that choice. Yeah. Look, check in with your media center more often, too. I mean, you want to talk about making decisions, that thing's going to be a lifesaver. I loaded up all the things with your daily tasks so you can figure out what you need to be doing. Come on, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I need you for, baby. I appreciate you. Just doing my job, man. Talking about my cooking. Welcome, everybody. Another night of G League basketball on the way. In this game, we'll see the Oklahoma City Blue against Team Ignite. Alongside Tim Sports and Brian Banifatemi, this is Blake Suniga, and tomorrow's NBA stars could be out there on the court today. Well, that's the fun of the G League, right? Everyone is looking to earn their chance at a spot in the NBA. In the world. It really is something special, guys. Now here's Newton. Count it. Two points. Here's the and the blue going the other way now. To the middle. Higgins with it. Lots of room. And he Two connects points. with the jumper. A talent jumping off the roster sheet. They'll need to fuse it all together over the course of the season, but this is one of the most talented lot can happen over the course of the year. Now here's Bennett. And yep, Two it's points. good. Outside Diaz. MP. Back to Diaz. MP on the wing. Drops in the tray. Yep, you admire how. Pass to Newton. Higgins outside. Inside. Chris, good. Two points. Given a the layup possible. MP outside. The tray. That's in there. Palmer with the assist. A player and well above 600 when it comes to winning percentage. That kind of dominance in the regular season, it is remarkable. Chris, Three good. Points. Joseph yeah, that Chris. kind of D, it's just not going to cut it, guys. They've got to get a hand in his face. Here's MP for three. And Team Ignite hits again from D. Institution for the three by MP. And here in the first, three minutes in. The top of the key jumper is on the... Not going to go that time. And Team Ignite going the other way now. Here's Thomas. He claims that one off his back iron. And it, it could be good in that we'll probably see fewer one and duns. Universities can now focus on players who might be there for a while. And that can help continuity, which is a big plus. MP back to Thomas. Pass to Lawson. MP right side. Six to shoot. That one drops and it comes off in a city. The D has not been able to keep up. Now here's Higgins. West. The 15 footer. Good. To the inside. Shots good by Higgins. That's the kind of lead pass we've come to expect from him. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Here's MP for three. And another three for Team Ignite. And MP is just taking. Thomas picks him up defensively. And stolen by MP. And Team Ignite on the break. And the dunk by Lawson. The break. Floating to the bucket just as soon as that ball was going the other way. And you see some of these guys go out to the three-point line, try to shoot three. It's not him. Just dunk it. And neither team could miss early on. 
I don't know how long they can keep this up. Offensively, at least. Neither team's done jack on D yet. That's fine with me. And he's got his first opportunity at the line here tonight. Oh, no good trying to beat the buzzer. Offense coming free and easy as we wrap up the first quarter. Team Ignite on top, up by four. And we've got more in store for you right after this. The G League hit hard by the pandemic. Really, every other league in the world, every sport, they had to cancel the end of the 2020 season. They played a, a shortened season in 2021 in a bubble in Orlando. Oh, too good on the shot. Woolridge covered by MP. To the paint. And Snow with the dunk. Jim Snow. Was set up in exactly the right spot. Beautiful screen, and the finish wasn't too bad either. Wonderful team basketball. Perfectly designed. Perfectly excellent over the big fella. Well, it was never going to be easy. A little artistry on the inside. Call it maybe a Rembrandt. There's Hollins. He hasn't yet put up any points in this one. Sinks the three-pointer. And with the G League. The right choice for the G League because teams were still able to develop their youth, and it was done in a safe and controlled environment. Only took him a few seconds to answer the free ball at the six. Down low. Hollins. That falls. Two points. Three to six. Here's Woolridge. He's guarded by Palmer. And stolen by AI. Now Team Ignite moving it up, and they pick up two. That's still covered by Bishop. Just five to shoot. Here's Higgins. Shot is good off the back rim and in. in for your and the big names for Team Ignite are part of the one-year program. They get compensated well as they prepare for the NBA draft. The team serve and stolen by Collins. Team Ignite on the break. Lost him with the bucket. And it's pretty hard not to. Yeah, I mean, when you look at the stats monitor, there's a stark discrepancy. When you look at the assist column, can you see that difference as far as fluidity in their respective offense? And you look at Team Ignite, it's a great way to get experience and prepare for the NBA draft. You can't overlook how paramount a professional said, Brian. If you get good in a hurry, there will be a lot to learn from any first-time team leaders. To Newton. With two seconds left, count that bucket. Henry Newton. And so we've reached That's the end of the first the half of the play. Team United ahead. ahead. They're up by seven. six. Okay. And we'll be back right after halftime to get the third quarter underway. I like that he maintained that energy throughout the entire half. I can't wait to see what he has up his sleeve for the second. Part of what makes the G League so exciting to follow is that it's brilliant. Double team MP. It's good. I am impressed to make in that situation. If there's any doubt at all, it should be a block. I agree. Give the offense the benefit of the doubt. And here's Fuller outside. Hits the three point. Stolen by Newton. Four on three on the break. Here's Higgins. And Higgins slams it in. Get two. Man, my old coaches would be so proud. I mean, that's the importance of great on the ball defense being showcased there. And the Oklahoma City Blue franchise has actually been around the extra trip to the foul line, and they continue to need to do that. They want to come back in this game. It is. Either way, it's been impressive. Maybe the, the coach just went up to the locker room chalkboard and just uh, put a number three out there. Fires it. And they cash in right away with a quick something they needed to more of. Get after it on the glass. It certainly wouldn't hurt. Some extra possessions would definitely help narrow the gap. And here's Palmer outside. And another three for Team Ignite. And a half through the fourth quarter now. Now here's Palmer. He's covered by Higgins. Palmer, that's good. And so he draws the foul on the shot, a trip to the line to shoot two. Third team shot. It's going to go on AI. The, the first one falls. Henry Newton taking two shots. And good on the second, so he makes now. Two minutes. 15-point game. Two minutes. 
Outside, Chris. That's in there. Bennett with the assist. Now here's MP. Guarded closely. This one for three. Good on the three-point shot. Uh, first development, it makes sense. Had a good run in college and the tournament, so I'm interested to see how he fares in the G League. Takes the three. And Team Ignite hits again from deep. Team feeling awfully good. And the other one bad. And that one drops for him. What? There's a screen. Bennett with the ball. And it's Mercer picking him up. It's good, and he Ricky threw contact on the shot, so it'll go to the line. Three-point play the opportunity. Ricky Hollins at the line for... Yeah, the only question here for us to follow is how big uh, the lead will eventually become. And that one, good. I don't want to stay to the side. Mix it out to Bishop. And he... And T. McKnight hits again for D. The end of McKnight taking care of business in this one. MP was unreal from beyond the arc. His teammates recognized it. They kept feeding him, and he kept delivering. Tonight, a big step forward for MP. He showed the ability to stretch the floor. That's imperative in today's game. And that's going to do it. Thanks for joining us for this presentation of G League Basketball. We'll see you next time.